An unusual flower bloomed today at UMass, which only happens every 7 to 12 years. From its name, the corpse flower, it doesn't exactly seem like something you would want to sniff, but that's not what Western Mass News reporter Lindsay Kane found when she got there. People are here in the UMass Amherst greenhouse today taking a smell at the corpse flower, and it does not smell good. Staff walked into the Marill greenhouse Wednesday morning to find that the corpse flower had bloomed, which is not an everyday event. Maybe every 7 to 10 or 12 years you can get a bloom out of these. But why is it called the corpse flower? It produces this odor, this smell of, well, rotting flesh. How else can you describe the smell? Like a dumpster. <laughs> Phillips tells Western Mass News the plant sits dormant until it stores up enough energy to bloom, but it only stays open for 24 to 36 hours before it closes up again. The odor is meant to attract pollinators like beetles or flies that either eat or lay eggs in the flower. Phillips says he's had a lot of visitors so far, but he's expecting at least 1,000 people will come out before the corpse flower closes again. So I've had a lot of people, especially on campus, employees and, and grad students and stuff on campus that would come through and have been checking it out and been on like corpse flower watch. Philip says the rest of the UMass campus is closed on Thursday for the 4th of July, but he will open the greenhouse from 11 to 4 for anyone who wants to stop and smell the flower. Lindsay Kane, Western Mass News.